Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvania toy collector. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we'll be reviewing Transformers Legacy Skywarp. Before we look at Skywarp himself, we're going to look at the packaging. Transformers Legacy Skywarp. Takara Tomy Generations Autobot Insignia. Ages 8 plus. <laughs> it's a pretty cool, cool figure. Definitely going to be glad to review this today. Got a product shot of Core Class Kingdom Skywarp. Core Class Skywarp. And he did not have any null rays because, man, I was so disappointed it didn't have any null rays when I got this figure. So I went and took my Universe Classic Starscream null rays and just painted them black. So we will have some custom null rays just for the sake of this review. Because what's Skywarp without his qu classic null rays? That's all there is to say. For the package in, let's look at Skywarp himself. And his jet mode is pretty G1 inspired. I love how this Skywarp looks. It looks awesome. Now for comparison, here is Legacy Core Class Skywarp next to Kingdom's Core Class Starscream. And they look good together. I hope they do another one of these Core Class G1 style Decepticons because I'd love to th see a Thundercracker in this core class line just to go with my good old Starscream and now my Skywarp. I just love how these look. And of course, what comparison would be complete without the leader of the Decepticons, Megatron? And yeah, I couldn't help that. Because, man, those are some good comparisons. But now we're going to transform Skywarp here on the channel. And this is the exact same transformation as Kingdom Core Class Starscream. So we're just going to disconnect this. Disconnect these. His chest, like so. We're going to... Disconnect his legs, accordion this down, like so, rotate, like so, flip back to form his bat pack, flip the nose cone down like so, straighten out his legs, like so, flip up his head, revealing that G1 style head sculpt, fold in his chest, like so, disconnect his arms and rotate. Second verse, just like the first, disconnect. And these null rays are custom pieces, so I did them myself. And I love to do some custom pieces whenever I think of customs to add to the playability of a classic figure. And this Legacy Skywarp is one of the best looking Skywarps I have. It's not as good as Earthrise. But it is pretty cool for a core class figure. I love how simple it looks and how well sculpted and painted this figure is. And yeah, he has the exact same transformation as Starscream. So, entirely the same. You can give him this, what, whatever this thing is. I think it's some sort of electro rod or something. But it's a weird weapon. You collect all the weapons to build a mega weapon with, with this. But Skywarp can use it as sort of an Autobot electric rod, and he'd be like, Take this, Bumblebee. I'll fry you to a Chris. Or fry you till you're unconscious. <laughs> and that couldn't be helped, the imitation that I was doing for Skywarp. But now we're going to get down to comparison with some other core class figures. Because, why not? I love some core class figures. Because these have been coming out for a while now. 
And I'm kind of getting deep into the Kingdom's Core class figures. And my review budget is a hundred bucks. So I always get these things for really good prices and I always get them for cheap. I get the ones I can afford right away and any big ones I save quite a few weeks of reviews and then buy the big ones, man, dependently. But here we got Kingdom Core Class Starscream with Skywarp. And they look good together. Why not? G1 looking figures. I love it. But now we're going to do one more transformation and comparison. We're going to compare them next to good old Leader Megs or Megatron if you want to be specific about it because he's Megatron. He is Megatron, our fierce Decepticon leader, Megatron. I've memorized his transformation so I could do him off camera. As much as I memorized Skywarp. I messed around with Kingdom Skywarp when first I got him and waited to review him. Because, man, I mess around with transformations until I'm used to them. Because, man, that's big important to me. I have to know how these figures convert and transform every time I get them. Because I... I love having fun transformation. Transforming them is fun. Back and forth. But here we got Kingdom Skywarp with his leader, Megatron. And they look good together. But yeah, these are going to go on my shelf together. And I hope they do a Legacy Core Class Thundercracker. Because, man... We need one to complete this wave of Seekers, man. We are lacking Thundercracker. And we need a Thundercracker in the house. So, Legacy, give us a Thundercracker to go with these two bots. Because, man, we need Thundercracker in our life. For sure. And that's all there is to say for this review. I enjoyed reviewing Skywarp today. And I hope you enjoyed this video. It was fun to get him in hand and finally review him. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out YouTube land.